Dear friend, I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way. But together, you and I will laugh at last night someday. Ice cream. He brought me ice cream, vanilla ice cream. Imagine that ice cream. And for the first time, we were together without a smile. Simply stunned. Well, wonders never cease. Well, wonders never cease. It's been a most peculiar day. Well, wonders never cease. Well, wonders never cease. Oh, where was I? I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way. But together, you and I will have it last night someday. I sat there waiting in that cafe and never guessing that you were fat. Oh. <laughs> that you were near. You were outside looking bald. Oh no. Dear friend, I am so sorry about last night. Last night, I was so nasty. Well, he deserved it, but even so, that George is not like this George. This is a new George that I don't know. Somehow, it all reminds me of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. When right before my eyes, a man that I despise has turned into a man I like. It's almost a dream, as strange as it may seem, he came to offer me vanilla. Sing that beautifully. Thank you. Um, Thank you. So here's here's something. When you're when you're doing a sh song from a show, this is from a musical called "She Loves Me," written by Bach and Harnick, who uh, it was the year before they wrote uh, "Fiddler on the Roof," and it's a terrific show. I just I saw the Broadway production last year. Um, but a lot of this song, a lot of the humor is based on the plot. Mm -hmm. So this might be a time when you might want to do a little setup for yourself. So do you know about the plot of yes. this? Okay. So this is about Amelia, who is yes. writing love letters to a guy. It's a, it's a correspondence service. So mm -hmm. she, what's the first lyric? Dear? Uh, dear friend. Dear friend. So dear friend is a guy she's writing to. She's never met him. And she has no idea that this guy she works with, who's so nasty to her all the time, George, yes. is actually dear friend. So... When she's writing to dear friend, she still doesn't know that George, but George just came over last night and brought her ice cream when she was sick. So she is writing to this guy who she's in love with on the letter, but then she's realizing, God, this guy is such a jerk, brought me ice cream. So you need some of this, you take the time to explain it to the audience so they can go on the journey with you. Okay. And the other idea that I would have, just to give you a little staging thing is, because you're, you're of two minds, you're both, I'm writing a letter to this guy I really like, but I'm now also thinking about this guy. Mm -hmm. I would suggest, dear friend, this way. So you're mm -hmm. saying, dear friend, and then you think about George and okay. put him over here so that you can give us the change in your head so you're being drawn, oh, but I wanna think about him because that was great. At mm -hmm. some point, you know, you can start bringing it forward but physicalize the mental dilemma for yourself and help tell the story. Because, you know, certainly 
It can be certainly true of singers singing things like I've got the world on a string. You know, you can in, in invent a character, a situation for yourself to interpret the song. But a song like this that was designed to help tell stories, you are a storyteller. So let's, you know, tell the story. Some of it you're going to give them maybe in a back, back, uh, little background before you start singing. But then you'll also continue uh, as the, the song goes along. And I think that a lot of the jokes that are inherent within the text will play better once they've been included in on the plot, because not everyone has seen um, She Loves Me. So anyway, just a couple of things for you to think about, but okay. I think you sing it beautifully, I think Thank you're you perfectly so cast, um, and I'm gonna let Michael uh, weigh in on some stuff. Oh. Uh, it's, it's really beautiful. I mean, you, you do sing uh, to perfection, and you have a, you so a, a million dollar smile, uh, <laughs> which I would like to rent from you sometime. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. So I, I really don't have, uh, I, I don't have any uh, vo comments vocally, uh, and, and Mark covered, covered it so thoroughly. Uh, I thought it was uh, wonderful. So, Thank you so much. So that's my critique. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so uh, w would you like to sing it yeah, let's, again let's, and, let's... and incorporate okay. some of his sage advice? Uh, um, would you like me to improv a little? A setup, you mean? You mean a setup? A setup, or? yes. Yeah, let's. Yeah, uh, uh, on the fly. Let's let's have you tell tell your version of this story, okay. and then uh, and then act it out accordingly. Or you could do a setup of Fiddler on the Roof if you'd like, <laughs> which might be interesting. Uh, no, I'm get out of the way. Uh, okay. So, I'm writing to this guy that I really like. I mean, he's just like me. He likes all the same books that I like. But then this guy that I work with, let me tell you, he's nasty. I don't like him at all. But he came and brought me ice cream last night. I don't know, maybe I like him. But I'm still writing to dear friend, so I, I should probably do that, okay. Dear friend. I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way. But together, you and I, We'll laugh at last night someday. Ice cream. He brought me ice cream. Vanilla ice cream. Imagine that. Ice cream. And for the first time, we were together without a spot. Friendly. He was so friendly. That isn't like him, I'm simply stunned. Well, wonders never cease, well, wonders never cease. It's been a most peculiar day. Well, wonders never cease, well, wonders never cease. Oh, where was I? I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way, but together you and I will have it last night someday. I sat there waiting in that cafe. And never guessing that you were fat. Oh. That you were near. Okay, so so here, so when you do your intro, and I think this is something that you, you uh, should work on tonight before you do it for the semis tomorrow. So you have to set up for them, and I, I forgot this until I heard you do it. So the night before, she is gonna finally meet dear friend, mm -hmm. and she goes, and he didn't show up. So when you're singing about this, of course what she's been worried about is what does dear friend look like? So this should be, so you have to come up with like a four sentence intro okay. that hits all these plot points so they know when, I didn't know that you were fat, it's this is what she's been worried okay. about, so you wanna let them know. I would also, so when you're singing, um, what, is the, what is the lyric you sing before you say ice cream for the first time, what is that? Um. We'll laugh at last night someday. Someday, and then your day. Ice cream. Make okay. that a. Oh, okay. I'm being drawn into my. Uh, I'm being pulled into this. That that first ice cream. Like, what was that about? Uh -huh. So I think you can get a little bit more comedic value okay. on the ice cream. Ice cream and just your total. You play more of the confusion right now. You've got. You're playing a lot of sweet. Uh -huh. I think just the. What the hell? <laughs> okay. And you can do that because you're ultimately getting to how excited you are about George at the end. Let, but yes. let's not, let's, let's, let's put some negative, like ice cream, 
you know, let's get the confusion mm -hmm. and stuff first before we get there so that the song arcs and stuff. Okay. So let me let, just t take it from, you know, the, the properness of Dear Friend and then just okay. give me, really give me the turn on, on the ice cream. Okay. And I'm going to stand over here. Dear friend, I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way. But together, you and I will laugh at last night someday. Ice cream. He brought me ice cream. Vanilla ice cream, imagine that! Ice cream, and for the first time we were together without a spot. Friendly, he was so friendly, that isn't like him. I'm simply stunned. Will wonders never cease? Will wonders never cease? It's been a most peculiar day. Will wonders never cease? Will wonders never cease? Oh, where was I? I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way, but together you and I will have a last night someday. Okay, I so do, 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 it's, it's, I think you do it well. Your instincts are right. The, it, the more diction you have on every single word, the, fun, uh, the funnier it is. Okay. So if you just, no, 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 if it gets like that, they won't laugh. But if you get the, the diction right, you know, that, that helps for, uh -huh. for that moment. And just remember... Don't, you don't give away all your excitement, you're so excited, it's still, it's like, I think I'm happy. Okay. But still be, because you say, it's been a most peculiar day, you don't understand that in the first one, because you're gonna repeat this the second time, you get, save okay. some of your utter enthusiasm for mm -hmm. that, so still play that. So okay. let's, but let's take it from this, this now her second, uh, the, uh, every day, yeah, give me that again. Wait, what? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> Yeah. Okay, okay. I am so sorry about last night. It was a nightmare in every way, but together you and I will have a last night someday. I sat there waiting in that cafe and never guessing that you were fat. Oh. That you were near. You were outside looking bald. Oh no. Dear friend, I am so sorry about last night. Last night, I was okay, so... Okay, so, so here's a little thing. So instead of turning your whole body, again, it's, it's funnier if you just like, last night, and it just okay. do it with just a head. Okay. Because it's... it's if you do this, you're almost, it's like you're fully committing to it, but she's uh -huh. being drawn out of her reverie. Okay. So it's like, last night, you know, mm -hmm. so against it, so find those little things, because a, a, a song like this that is both, it's a, it's a great song for a soprano, but it's, it's comedy, it's, it's, uh -huh. it's, it's the uh, Bach and Harnick have musicalized a woman who is, uh, her world is being shaken because this guy is so nasty to her, mm -hmm suddenly is nice and she doesn't understand that and suddenly uh, that their connection is coming through. Yeah. The other thing you have to explain to the audience, which I have forgotten because boy, this is a complicated plot, <laughs> is that they were both supposed to meet at this restaurant for the first time. He showed up, saw that Amelia was there and he realizes, oh my God, this is who I've been corresponding with. So he showed up and told Amelia, oh, I saw the guy who was looking for you. He's bald and he's fat and middle-aged. <laughs> so he has now told her that the guy she's in love with or thinks she's in love with looks horrible or looks like me. Oh, dear. <laughs> um, well, this has become the most depressing songbook <laughs> competition. <laughs> anyway. So, so make sure that you, when you do your setup, and you know, I'm giving you a whole list of things, yes. but literally it pays off once you sing the song, uh -huh. okay? And we're time, okay. Well, anyway, I think you sing it great. So now you, so you just need a little setup, a little head turn, you're, you're golden, all right? Thank you so much, thank you. Thank you, darling. Thank you, thank you.